number one lab one. Uh, this is just going to be a quick video about generating random numbers on our calculators. So I'll just start reading this lab, which is after lesson 10 in our Algebra 1 book. It says a set of random integers has no pattern. Some common methods for generating random integers include rolling a number cube or drawing numbers out of a hat. A graphing calculator can also be used to generate random integers. Generate three random integers between 1 and 12. Well, our calculators have a really easy tool to use in order to find random integers. What we need to do first is press this math button underneath alpha. And uh, this has a lot of different things, but what we need here is basically the probability tab. So I'm going to use the right arrow to go over to the probability tab. And then within this, we have some different random number generators. The one that we want for a random integer says rand int, so number five. Uh, this gives us a few different fields to plug in. And since I want three random numbers between one and 12, my lower number that I want is one, and my upper number is 12. You can press enter or the down key to get to the different fields. And then n means how many numbers do you want? Well, I want three of them. So once it's blinking on paste, I can press enter and it'll put this into your calculator page and press enter one more time to get your three random integers. And for me, my random integers were 12, 11, and two. Uh, you can continue to do this and um, get another set of three if you would like, or you can go back to that page in the math section in order to do a different set. Maybe you want it between 5 and 15. Oops. 5 and 15, and you want 10 numbers. That is fine. Just um, press your enter buttons a couple times, and you will get 10 random integers between 5 and 15. So this is how we calculate random integers on a calculator.